Last season, the Bayern Munich women's team celebrated their first German championship since 1976. And as a consequence, Thomas Werler's team now competes in the Women's Champions League. Consisting of 32 teams, the competition kicks off not with the group stage, but immediately goes into knockout ties. The first of which Bayern Munich played last week in Inchida. Against Twinta, Melanie Lothholz scored a late and thoroughly deserved equalizer, which gives the Bayern women plenty of hope they can progress to the round of 16 with a home win tomorrow evening in the Grunwalder Stadium in Munich. We're really looking forward to this absolute highlight. It's a knockout match, a real final. We want to progress to the next round, and while it will be extremely difficult to achieve, everyone will certainly do their very best. We're not going for a draw. We want to attack and win the game rather than start to worry whenever Twente have the ball in the last few minutes. We want to decide this match prematurely. While Thomas Werler's team is looking forward to a real season highlight, most of Bayern's male professionals enjoyed a successful week with their national teams. Manuel Neuer, Thomas Müller, Jerome Boateng and Mario Götze, who sadly sustained a year-ending injury, qualified for the European Championships with the German national team, while scoring machine Robert Lewandowski did what he does best as he netted his 13th goal in Poland's successful run for France. David Alaba's Austrian national team finished the qualification in impressive style as table first, while Thiago also qualified for France with the Spanish national team on top of their group table. The only real top team in jeopardy of not qualifying is Holland, who are missing Arjen Robben. Bayern's star winger is one of several Bayern players who stayed in Munich to work on regaining his fitness. While Jan Kirchhoff was able to train with the team for the first time since his return to Munich in summer, Robin has made good progress in the past weeks and is now hoping he can grab a squad place on Saturday in Bremen. Mary Benatia, who has just been nominated for the 2015 African Player of the Year award, is currently running laps every day, but will require some more time before he can play for Bayern again. Holger Badstuber and Juan Benat are hoping they can return to full team training this week and thus take the final step in their recovery process, while Franck Ribéry will certainly need a few more weeks before he can train fully following his return to the pitch this week. The only players currently unable to train at all are Sebastian Rode and Mario Götze. Kingsley Coman fortunately only sustained a minor injury while playing for the French under-21s and is merely forced to sit out a few days of training. Keep your fingers crossed that all of Bayern's injured players can make it back into the squad sooner than later because another really busy schedule awaits the Bayern players in the upcoming weeks. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Have a great week and Auf Wiedersehen.